Well, the Acadian kickoff tour continuing tonight. Pine Prairie football has been stuck at three wins since 2014. Each season, the Panthers feel a yard or two closer to finally breaking through, but each season, three wins seems to be the cap. But as we said last year, perhaps this season is the season. Head coach Eves Prince brings his largest senior class back, and last year's seniors have hung around to serve and help this year's team. That graduated senior class was just a break or two from a 500 season. Prime Prairie lost it to nine when Iota by a touchdown and had a 4A Beauchamp team on the ropes in week three. The team felt so close to breaking through and believes this year is finally when Pine Prairie grabs its first 500 season. We had a lot of close games that we should have won with big teams. Um, and we feel that if we keep working hard, we'll, we'll be able to beat those teams in those close games. And we just keep working just like we did last season or more. If our kids learning to compete right now, and that's the most important thing. You know, both chain, we, we was up about 27 points and lost about two points at the end. But, it, you know, is, a, is to show our kids that they could compete with these teams. Well, the tour continues all weekend long. Erath and Generate on Saturday, Eunice and Crowley. Then on Sunday, we begin the work week with Southside and Catholic High of New Iberia. As always, you can check out any Acadiana kickoff tour previews you may have missed over on KTC.com. Well, game two of the TCL championship tonight. The Cane Cutters fall 12 to six at Victoria to the Generals. The series now split one game apiece. A decisive game three is tomorrow.